we want to express humility and genuine gratitude uh, to the overwhelming flood of well wishes, not just from this magnificent community of Sorrento, where he was born and loved, lived and loved, but from every corner of our community. It's just a, a tragedy for, for his family and, and, um, and, and friends to be going through what they're going through and uh, the club's feeling it as well. It's um, just a tragic circumstance. It does put things in perspective. It's one of those moments, I guess, we come to realise that being an AFL footballer doesn't give you a, an immunity to uh, tragedies. Uh, you know, a lot of boys would like to think they wear a Superman suit, suit around, but unfortunately, uh, that's not the case, and it brings things back to reality. So. He always had a smile on his face. He was always someone who uh, he was positive, always for us on the ground, went hard at a contest, and he was always someone you could talk to and rely on to, um, I guess, follow what we were trying to do around the football clubs. Definitely shocked us, as we said before. It's just, um, it just seems so surreal that, yeah, it just something like that happens. Hit you like a rock. It, uh, I think you uh, think of your own situation, your own family. You know, my, th my thoughts straight away, my thoughts, obviously the friends were there who were, who were obviously grief stricken, but the family, and you think of yourself in your own situation. Yeah. That could happen to your family. We've all got very heavy hearts, and uh, um, and, and our, our heart just goes out to, to John's family and those who are closest to him. It's a tough day for AFL football, and it certainly puts everything into perspective. You think of those football clubs and John's family at the moment, it's an absolute tragedy. It is with a, a very heavy heart, and I, and I sincerely mean that. I've coached John for a number of years and uh, had a lot to do with his family as a young man. He was a unique, a precious and loved young man. It's a pretty chilling moment for players involved in finals, the national anthem, but even more so when it includes a minute's silence for the loss of one of their own. Let's go to the MCG. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain upstanding for the National Anthem of Australia. <laughs> 